Hey, what's up? Just me here today, because, uh, unfortunately work got a little hectic and, uh, me and, uh, Gibberish couldn't meet up to do our normal recording session, so... Wah, wah. So, just me, and I thought it'd be actually kind of fun to, uh, go back through some of the clips that I've done on Twitch, or that were done of me. You, 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 you know what I mean. And, uh, just gotta show them off and, uh, kinda give a little in insight. Because I I'm not gonna lie, some of these are pretty old. We got some that are three years old, two years old. I mean, just looking at most views, some of these have some age to it. Let's get to it. Alright, this one's just called Insert Falcon Crying. I have no idea what this is. No, I have no idea. <laughs> My life is a lie. What the heck was the context for that? Holy cow! Why does that have almost 40 views? I'm so confused. Oh, I think I remember. I, th I was overreacting to, um... Uh, I forgot what the what the command is to, to the echo. But it was like... I think it was like, what echo. What happens if you divide by zero? The answer is complex infinity. Did that answer your question? All right, that wasn't it. <sighs> Thanks for your feedback. Yeah, whatever, Echo. Um, it, it was something like... It, it was something... It was something like you couldn't, Cookie Monster would have no, ah, God, it was something that regarding like Cookie Monster would have no cookies and, and you're sad because you have no friends or something like that. Man, I wish I could remember what that Easter egg was. It's going to be lost to, forever to me now. I, though I still have no idea why the clip is popular. God, this might be one of my oldest clips ever. Like, holy cow. This was back before I had emotes. My frickin' user pay, my user icon was a frickin' uh, clip from, from an Oogloff, uh, um, comic. I had no green screen, that was back before I put a blanket over my rear windows, that was back when my studio was my bedroom. Man, this was so long ago. I had no idea where I'd place that. On your desk. That thing that's in front of you. Uh... The problem is, is where on my desk? Clean your desk. <laughs> <laughs> I mean... That, that is the correct answer. Clean your desk. Now, at this time, I think I was still using a snowball. Maybe I had the Yeti? But I don't recall. I know I don't have that shirt anymore. That shirt is so tote. That that shirt I know is absolute toast. Man, those headphones are toast. Then again, I did abuse those headphones. But no, that was regret the van. Uh, I do stuff with them okay occasionally. I actually we recently actually did a co stream with them. But uh, since then, he, he actually now has a Yeti like I used to. But uh, back then, him and I were doing Eagle Eyes on Tech. That was back when I actually had a co-host. I'm trying to do co-host again, but uh, no interest is peaking. So, solo jobs they go. But um, yeah, uh, we, we're, uh, we were talking. It's just like, you need to upgrade your mic. And he's just like, where did I put it? And he was just like trying to dodge getting a $30 mic. I think at that time I quoted him 50 but nowadays you can 
I even back then the the snowball ice was like still better than it is like nothing headset mic or webcam mic or whatever he was using at the time and still would have been better and it's just like look man I was like I actually don't remember what my what my situation was back back then financially it's just like like back then I totally would have just been like here snowball here you go if we're gonna keep doing this uh so I don't remember why, but I remember I had to kill the borders doing this. This is a fairly recent one. You can see I have the AKGs. I have the AT2020 or AT2020 or 2035, whatever the heck that is. And um, man, what the heck were we doing at the time? We've got like, we've, we've got the jute box going, but um, I mean, nowadays you can't anymore. Party pack six. Alexa can't compute correctly. Let's see. Which one do you want to cancel? The 13 hour one. Oh. You don't have a timer for 13 hours, but there are timers for three minutes and 13 hours and 23 minutes. Oh my God. And that one. Echo. Oh my God. And the, and the long timer. Sorry, I'm having some trouble. Echo, stop all timers. Canceling all your timers. Echo, set a timer for two minutes. Two minutes, starting now. Jesus Christ. Idiot. Here's something I found on Wiktionary. I have a few definitions for Christ. One, there's a proper noun. The anointed one on the side predicted in the Hebrew Bible. Shut up. <laughs> Ah, man, adding the echo to the mixer was the smartest decision. I, oh my God, I set it off. What are you, what stupid thing are you about to say, Echo? Come on, just say it. Whatever stupid thing you're about to say, just say it. Just say it. It didn't. Okay. Oh man. But yeah, I don't know. I can't remember what was going on that day, but like the CPU was like overloading like nobody's business. There must have been like some nonsense I was running in the background that just was way too much. All right, so this is a this is a good point. I spent way too much time on this joke. Like this should have been a 20 second joke and I had it go on for how long? 54 seconds oh god Th this honestly makes me cringe but this was a good learning moment what gives more defense ironclad armor able to stop the strongest strike or a cool fur coat what do you think is more likely to stop defense to be more protect that's it end of joke i, d I don't even want to look at the rest of it i i, I don't I, I had this drag on way too long. That being said, why the hell does sturdy armor give less defense than a fur coat? They don't understand game. All right, this was golf with friends and uh, the other voice I remember is uh, Andy who um, he's been around a, a lot more lately. But, but, you know, there's a huge time zone conflict with me, with me and Andy. Andy is in, I want, oh God, he's going to shoot me now. Um, the Czech Republic, I think the point is he's like 10 hours ahead of me or something crazy like that. So when I stream at 7 PM, you know, that's freaking 3 AM his time or something like that. God. Well, Eagle, why are you so still looking for the <laughs> like, stupid ways how to waste your strokes? Well, because it's Not funny. trying to, it, it just happens. Well, stop this shit. <laughs> 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 oh, 
Oh my god. People wonder why I venture off from RPGs from time to time. This is why. This kind of stupid nonsense. Because it is just, you know, amazing. Oh. Moments like that are just... They can be so much fun. All right. This is a Tales of Bazuria clip. I, I remember which one this was. This, this one actually did take off quite a bit compared to my, my normal clips. Like, most people don't really share a lot of my clips, which is fine. I get it. It's also, you know, Twitch doesn't give a good way of just, like, going down a clip rabbit hole at all. Like, you've got to go out and, like, spam your clips if you want them to be exposed. But this one actually took off a little bit. I do not remember who the heck Mixer Replacement Donor 5 is. I think someone was just, like, did a $10 donation and was just memeing with that, with that, with that. I don't remember who. But we were really messing around with uh I wish I had power like that. <laughs> with those, with those outfits. <laughs> the deadpan <laughs> stare. <laughs> the deadpan stare of those outfits is just fucking I I mean you tell me they're not looking into your soul. God, Bazuria. I had such a bad time with it because, man, that game punishes you so hard for underleveling. It hurt. It hurts so much. But, I mean, honestly, the game is fun, even though its story is stupid and you absolutely should make fun of it at every stretch you can. As long as you stay up to level, it actually is a good time. I had a bad experience with it just because... Man, you, if you're under level, it punishes you hard. One of my earliest attempts at like doing silly voices right here. Sit. Terrible tragedy. Oh, I I'd stay away from that Yosepa power, you. He seems to be some sort of trivia god, constantly winning these damn games, killing the rest of you all. Tragic. If only more people would just learn and not challenge him to deadly trivia games. Catch up to you. More people would be alive. And fewer people would have to st spin that dreaded loser wheel. Tragic. It's not that bad. I, I could probably do it. I mean, first off, much better mic means I can do it much better now. I mean, here, let's actually qu quick quickly try. Terrible tragedy. I'd stay away from that Yosep about you. They say terrible things happen with him. Something about deadly trivia games and constantly dying. As long as you avoid that wheel, everything will be much, much better. Oh boy. Now if you'll excuse me, I'm gonna go find my pants. They seem to have vanished. I'm not gonna lie, I have no idea how well that turned out because what I hear is slightly different than what the mic actually picks up. That was my best attempt. Alexa knows a certain skill. Oh boy. How did my echo mess up this time? This is actually fairly recent. This is 10. This was, um, this is when I hit 70, isn't it? No, 60. All right. That sounds like fun. Also echo. Th that green screen. What the fuck is making that noise? I'd rather not answer that. Are you part? Are you behind it? Sorry, I don't know that, but this I do have a skill you might like. It's called fart. <laughs> Wanna try it? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Uh oh, that was a viewer asked one. You can actually see in the chat. It's Gabe and you a asked what. <laughs> Had had me ask ask that to the to the to the echo. So actually, on my stream, uh, the channel points that are integrated into Twitch, uh, one of them I have is just have have me ask my echo something, and that's what it was right there. So yay! Uh, a rare moment in trivia murder party. This was good. Ooh, let's see what you did there. So they all had to make words. 
and the shortest word died. Ah! <laughs> tie? That's not good for anybody. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops! That was amazing. <laughs> I have uh, no idea if I would have been, if I would have died in there one. too or not. Oh man, let me actually see if I could. Ooh, oh. Let's see what you got. Ah, dang it! All right, there we go. Um, man, just glancing at this, I see is P L E A S E. But that's only six. So I would have died. That's like the first one I see right off the bat. Which words did they come up with again? Helpers, players, and tangles. Wow. So if I ended up in there, they would have they would have all lived. The fact that it's three sevens, that's amazing. All right, this one's just titled when you have too much luck. I legit have no idea what the story is with this. So by the way, we did a lot of trivia murder party for a while because we were trying to find all the Easter eggs. We did find like two or three. I want to say I found three and we knew of four or five, I think. I can't remember anymore. But that's why we played so much trivia murder party back in the day. Let's see what this one is. Oh, whoops! I accidentally muted it. Ba -ba 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 -ba. There we go. Who picked this? Dang it! Dang it! Dang it! Dang it! Dang it! Dang it! I knew it! I freaking knew it! And I doubted myself. Oh my god! Oh, I remember. I remember this now. Oh, those are the worst. Give me arm. Oh, come on! <laughs> Why aren't you spinning the wheel? I'm oh! Ah! Spin, my lovely man! The doubting yourself at the last minute and boom! <laughs> Aren't you cute? <laughs> and there goes all my luck for the week. It's yeah, there went all my luck. And I, I'd like some of that luck back, uh, you know, with it being 2020 and all. I could use some. Fix. I love that room code. Oh my god. I don't know who kept donating, like, a buck fifty with the name Bondage Lolis. But man, that was... That that is a joke that's funnier now. Now that it's not ha now that it's not like at the moment. But man, that was so annoying back in the day. Woo! All right, this one again is a uh, Dongan Rampa spoiler. Also, what? Investigation. Once they are discovered, we shall eliminate them immediately. That old man wants you to lick his foot. Wait a minute. <laughs> Something is uh, wrong with that statement. <clears throat> Everything is for the sake of a future filled with hope. So the other thing, actually, real quick, I'll mention about uh, there actually was. I mean, this is kind of spoiler territory for uh, Danganronpa 2, but Good luck figuring out how it's spoiler territory. But, um, so a couple of things I'll actually point out about this. Back when I did Danganronpa, I did it during the Saturday night streams. I used to do a stream at like 10 o'clock and it would go until 2 a.m. Uh, I don't do that anymore. Mostly because uh, I use my Saturday nights now to do stream prep for the podcast as well as just relaxing i mean i i stream freaking five days a week every um sa sunday monday wednesday thursday and saturday so i mean i already stream quite a bit and i 
part of me has always like wondered if I should like scale back a day because I feel like with work and um how I keep pushing myself like the streams have just been like really dull than I'd like them to be and I feel like maybe some time off would help help rejuvenate a bit but this was like kind of one of the reasons investigation once they are discovered we shall eliminate them immediately that old man wants you to lick his quick wait a minute <laughs> something is uh wrong with that statement i'm not allowed to go that I'm, I'm like rubbing my eyes i'm like half asleep the there's no emotion in my voice it's just like god It seemed like a good idea at the time to do spooky, uh, s spooky games on Saturday night. But man, that, uh, looking back at it, that was a bad move. And I'm glad I don't do it anymore. Poor unknown woman. Okay, I know what this is. This is actually a, pr a pretty fun, sudden Easter egg. Here's another one. I haven't driven a car in years. You know, now that I WFH, work from home. <laughs> but tell me this. Okay then. What car part was replaced by fuel injection? Oh wait, no, it's not an Easter egg. It's just part of the question. But that's another reason why I feel like I kind of overwork myself a bit too much. That's it? That's your reaction to, from home. to, to screeching? Just... But tell me this. Okay, then. What car part Okay, was then? By... Uh, those moments where you look back at yourself and you're just like, God damn it, man. And this is actually a fairly old one. How old is this one? Two, over two years old. Oh, yeah, I've come a long way. Man, that was two years ago. I'm actually coming up now on frickin'. Five years. January 2021 20, will be my uh, five year anniversary. Man. So, yeah, this is another one Golf with Friends. Holy cow, I forgot that I managed to fit that EV on there. That EV is massive. I mean, there are bigger ones, but it is massive for a small plushie. And like, if it weren't for the fact that uh, I, what I should have done when I went plushie shopping is that I should have brought the shock mount with me. I should have just bit the bullet, unscrewed it, and just took it off. But you know, hindsight's twenty twenty and all. But yeah, this was one where I had uh, a jukebox as well. And nowadays you just can't do that anymore. Here we go. <laughs> what the fuck was that? <laughs> Jesus Christ. That is like one of the things I, I do like about golf with friends. You can just have like so many people just like, just like in there. So it is a good um, interactive stream to say the least. I actually should probably do some more of those. It has been a while. It'd be a good idea to get back into that sort of thing. But the fricking... The jute boxes, unfortunately, that was one of the, that was like the biggest downside back in the day was songs like that. And they do make for good moments. They do. But nowadays the DMCA takedown potential is just not worth it. Wah, wah. Golf with your friends. This was so infuriating. You know, whoever came up with water hazards in golf, I need to find them. They must pay for their crimes. They do, by the way. Fuck. <laughs> oh, come on! What was that on-screen chat thing? Fuck. <laughs> oh, come on!
I can't remember if that's actually built into the game or if that was actually the on-screen chat. I think this is actually the in-game one. And we were trying to get people to like say, hey, go join the stream. Nowadays, the game game's probably like this was during the peak of golf with your friends. Nowadays, that's probably nowhere near as popular. I don't know, though. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'll have to go in and find out how wrong I am. Ah! Get your game on. I mean, I can already see how this nonsense is going to go. This is why we do this, folks. Yep, this is why we do this. <laughs> this is coming the fuck everywhere. For, for F's sake. And it's gonna tie too. Watch. Moving into overtime. <laughs> Show your support for your answer by tapping on your device as fast as you can. Gun, you can hear my mic. Or my my, my mic. I'd hope you could hear my mic. You can hear my mouse. That tie went bye bye. Oh man! All Star lost to All Star. At least Smash Mouth beat Shrek. Oh, that's why I was betting. I had I, I had a prediction built into it. To determine our finals. Memes. Rose May Mays. But but I do have a, a structured settlement. Man, JG Wentworth. We just haven't seen a lot of uh, JG Wentworth memes lately. I don't know. Maybe I will actually do some Jackbox. Soon. Maybe that'll be a Saturday thing. I don't know. I I do miss the Jackbox, but man, for a while the Jackbox community, not not the regulars that I have for Jackbox, but like the randos you pick up were so toxic that it like it like killed my mood towards Jackbox. And I had so much love for the game. But holy cow. That got so toxic. It was just a bad time. I'm pretty sure this is so early in V3 that it's not a spoiler. But, you know, Danganronpa, possibly spoilers. Danganronpa is just one of those games that you got, like, you have to, you have to inform people. It's just like, this could be a spoiler because there is zero replayability in the game. There just isn't. Hey, Siri. What is a keto? Kim Gabori, better known by his pseudonym Akito, stylized as a keto, is a Canadian electronic rock musician and composer. Should I <laughs> No, that's enough. All right, so apparently she is a musician, according to Siri. Now let's actually look it up. Oh my god, this kind of nonsense is exactly what inspired thinking back to it. This is basically like the earliest example I could think of involving the freaking um, the concept of hooking up an Echo Dot to the mixer. Oh man, Siri was so bad back then. And of course now I don't have an iPhone anymore. Those were the days. This was after uh, partnership, though, or not a par partnership. Yeah, I wish. This was after I got affiliate status, though. You can tell there's bits down there and whatnot. Though, man, there's some names I haven't seen in a while. We've got what? Um, I love cats. And Opal Essence. Opal Essence was a uh, regular for a while. I don't know what happened to him or her. Probably I just got boring and then that was it. Wah, wah. And you know, it, it happens. Tastes change. Or people just go, go out to college. I mean, Fan was a regular for so long. He was actually one of my first viewers, but um, you know, he took a four year degree and well, we didn't see him for four years. Or a two-year degree. I can't remember. I, I say four-year degree. I don't know. 
I, I should I should clarify that. But you know, he went to Kuleg and then he he gets back when he can. But you know, it's it's still kind of cool to know that um that like he was like one of the two. It was uh, Fan and uh, Grim Senpai. I don't know what happened to Grim Senpai, but Fan still around since literally day one. And it's kind of weird to think back on it like that. Man. All right, so this one actually does have a Dongan Rampa spoiler in it. So uh, you know. Excuse me, jump ahead a little bit. Maybe I'll actually put this at the end so you can just like close out. But this is a Danganronpa 1 spoiler that's about to be coming up. But um, a couple of things I want to kind of point out first. Um, this is a, this is actually an older older one. I mean, first off, the older text and whatnot. I still have my Razor headset. And the only reason that mic is down is because the headset actually had this unique feature where it fed my own voice back into the headset um by the way don't do that you can in fact just plug your headphones into the yeti right there and as you get real-time feedback and you can feed audio to the yeti so you get that pre-mixed you don't have to do this ah young me was so dumb Anyway, locked. I'm gonna say this is a classroom with nothing value. Oh my god! Oh boy! Man, I wonder if bad shit happened here. <clears throat> so. I actually, when I did Danganronpa, actually did voice act everything poorly. So that actually was like a moment of actual shock. Because up until this point, and this is chapter five, by the way, keep that in mind. This is the, this is the set, this is the last chapter where you're act. all right, no, the second to last chapter where you're actually discovering stuff. And this one, you actually, in one, you actually did get access to new areas for the last chapter. But up until now, all the classrooms were boring. It was just like, yep, there's a chalkboard. There's some desks. There's a board up thing. They waited until the last chapter, if you remember, to pull this off. It was actually legitimately surprising. The other thing, I don't know if I actually talked about at the time, the blood is actually blood colored. It actually is kind of that like rusty red that you'd see from like, you know, real blood. Dangan Rampa, whenever there's fresh blood, it was like Pepto Bismol pink, like a magenta almost. It w and it, it was, and. People say that they did it for censorship, but this scene right here is my counterpoint to that. If the blood was pink for the sole purpose of censorship, why is the blood here blood colored? It is absolutely 100% an art style thing that they just decided to go with. And, you know, actually, uh, I don't know. Maybe it was like for some minor censorship to get passed for like trailers or whatnot, for advertisements. That could still be a possibility. But I don't know, it's just been kind of their thing. Apparent, apparently, uh, Black Blood is also a thing in the Persona series too. We found that out too. Ah, uh, well. Legit surprise. I can't actually believe that this one actually got quite a few views. That is a bit surprising.
journeys we are meant to take Something at the edge of space